Chapter 249, The Counterattack of the Supernatural Branch Wang He's defeat did not cause much shock. However, the comments in the live stream were about to go crazy. They were all confused. What ability did Zutui use? How did Zutui win? Why was Zutui able to take two steps back from Wang He's explosive attack and remain unscathed? Many curious emperors were about to go crazy. Even if the genetic abilities displayed by the other students were powerful, they could roughly analyze them after taking a look. However, they were extremely curious about the ability that Zutui displayed at this moment. Especially when he blocked the explosion from the stab explosion. Many people could not understand. Of course, Zutui would not say it unless someone could analyze it. The energy field of the genetic ancient martial arts was Zutui's last resort. He would not reveal it easily. Of course, many people could not think of it because of their inadequate knowledge. Who would have thought that a big shot in the mystery branch would cultivate genetic ancient martial arts? It was like Wang He's attack just now. Actually, Su Tui was very relaxed when he dodged the attacks. He did not even have to use time distortion. He dodged the attack with his extremely fast reflexes. However, Su Tui could not dodge this explosion. Even if he used time distortion, it was only the most logical defense. He would not be able to dodge it. This was an AoE attack. At this moment, the energy field defense cultivated from the lesser heavenly cycle of the genetic ancient martial arts came in handy. After the mental shield weakened the power of the explosion, the energy field successfully blocked the explosion of Wang He's energy field. However, the power of Wang He's explosion was really powerful. Even though he managed to block it with the energy field that was closest to his body, the shockwave still made Zhu Tui take two steps back. Wang He could not understand either. However, he could not ask about such personal abilities. Even if he asked, the other party would not tell him. Wang He picked up his broken ear and quickly walked towards the medical room. Breaking an ear and replanting it was just a minor surgery. Thank you. Wang even thanked Zhu Tui before he left the arena. Zhu Tui had cut off his ear during the attack just now. In that case, Zhu Tui could have shot him in the head. He had shown mercy again. Zhu Tui smiled and nodded slightly. An eye for an eye. Zhu Tui would also show kindness to those who were kind to him. In the arena, Zhu Tui looked in Wen Xiao's direction as usual. He originally wanted to mock Wen Xiao again before pulling the aggro. However, when he looked over, he did not find Wen Xiao. Of course, this was not a problem for Zhu Tui. Mr. Wen, did you run away after seeing that I won again and couldn't take the blow? First year supernatural students, do you see this? This is my combat strength. You can't compare to me. However, what you can't compare the most is my courage. It was already very dangerous just now, but I still have to continue challenging myself. You guys are already so cowardly that you don't even have the right to compete with me. I definitely have the right to look down on you in this aspect. Zutuis Daily Aggro Series Even the first year supernatural type seated players had grown some resistance to the third wave of fatal mockery. However, they still could not take it when they saw Zutui mocking them. All of them were red-faced and panting heavily. Someone was about to make a move. Wen Xiao, who had sat on a low stool to prevent himself from being whipped by Zutuis words, had no choice but to get up and calm the students down. But he only showed his head. Wen Xiao sat down again and quickly replied. Just now, Wen Xiao had sent a message to his teacher, Zheng Shahan. Teacher, Zhu Tui has won against Wang He, who is ranked 85th on the Longhu overall rankings. He has received a lot of bonus points in his overall ranking. Wen Xiao could no longer care about whether it was a secret or not. In any case, everyone knew that he was fighting for first place in the individual overall score. It was not a problem to say it directly in the communication channel. Wen Xiao had to be anxious. Why did Wen Xiao give Zhu Tui a warning? It was because Wen Xiao and the others had calculated that under normal circumstances, Zhu Tui's overall score would be first. Moreover, he's in first place with a huge leap. Even if they gave the students points within the rules, they would not be able to beat Zhu Tui. It could not be helped. The results of Zutui discovering the 8th type of reaction speed genetic base point had added a lot of points. In the end, Wen Xiao found an opportunity and gave Zutui a warning. 
their students could not beat Zhu Tun in terms of points, so he would reduce Zhu Tui's score. It worked, however, Zhu Tui was now challenging the Longhu overall rankings. Most students did not know about the bonus points policy of the Longhu overall rankings, but when Xiao did, Zhu Tui's current ranking of 85th place was 150 points. This discovery made Wen Xiao's teeth ache. Could Zhu Tui just stop? Wen Xiao was badly battered by the leg-breaking technique, which did not allow him to score points for the first-year Supernatural Branches teaching assessment. Even his reputation was about to be ruined. Now that he had suddenly gained 150 points from the Longhu overall rankings, he could no longer hold back. Zhu Tui was going to be ranked first in the individual overall assessment. Once that happened, Wen Xiao would really vomit blood. He had secretly given Zhu Tui a warning and punished him. Wasn't it to help the specially recruited students of the supernatural branch get first place in the individual overall assessment? Now that Zhu Tui had caused a ruckus, his reputation was about to be tarnished. If the first place in the individual overall assessment were to run away, then what's the point of Wen Xiao and the others arranging all of this? They would not be considered idiots. They would be considered as a fighter jet among idiots. It would have been better if he had done nothing back then, but now, since he had done it, he had to go all the way. Wen Xiao, who had discovered Zhu Tui's true goal in challenging the Longhu overall rankings, immediately sought help from his teacher, Zheng Shahang. To be honest, Wen Xiao's heart was already in a mess after being mocked and whipped by Zhu Tui time and time again. After sending the message, Wen Xiao looked at his communication device nervously. He wondered how his teacher would react. In less than 30 seconds, Wen Xiao's personal communication device rang. His teacher, Zheng Shahong, had replied. I got it, just three words. Wen Xiao became a little anxious when he saw those words. Wen Xiao, who was a little flustered, hurriedly sent another message. Teacher, what should we do? In the office, Zheng Shahong, who was watching the live broadcast, frowned when he saw Wen Xiao's questioning. He instantly realized that Wen Xiao's judgment had been affected by Zhu Tui. Wen Xiao, calmness is the most important thing. After teaching Wen Xiao a lesson, Zheng Shahong casually replied, it's also a good thing for Zhu Tui to be ranked on the Longhu overall rankings. However, Zhu Tui will have to bear the corresponding risks as long as he makes it onto the Longhu overall rankings. Those who make it onto the Longhu overall rankings can be challenged by any student within the rules. Don't worry, this was because he was using his personal communication device to communicate. There were some things that he could not say to directly. However, as his student, Wen Xiao instantly understood what Zheng Shahan meant. Zhu Tui would be challenged by others once he was on the rankings. This was Hishan's. As for who would come to challenge him, the words don't worry and Zheng Xiaohong's message represented the answer. This meant that Zheng Xiaohong had already made arrangements. In an instant, Wen Xiao, who understood what his teacher meant, felt relieved. He also stood up again. He looked at the main stage of the Longhu list curiously. Wen Xiao wanted to know who his teacher would send to challenge Zhu Tui. Wen Xiao knew his teacher, Zheng Xiaohong, very well. In the eyes of all the first-year and fourth-year students in the Huaxia Genetic Evolution College, Zheng Shahong was their teacher. On the main stage of the Longhu list, Ku Qingshan, the referee on duty, spoke. Zhu Tui, do you still want to continue? However, I personally suggest that you should rest since you have already won two rounds in a row today. Thank you, Professor Ku. Zhu Tui took a bottle of mineral water from Chai Zhao and washed the blood off the flying sword. But I still want to challenge the rankings. I want to get a higher ranking, Zhu Tui said as he looked up. All right, please report the challenge ranking to me within 10 minutes. We'll try to finish this battle before noon. I still like to rest for a while in the afternoon. Ku Qingshan smiled. Zhu Tui's gaze scanned the Longhu list. To be honest, Wang He's performance in the battle just now was very amazing. It was specifically used to defend against Zhu Tui's mental whip. His perception ability had avoided Zhu Tui's mental alls. It had a powerful offensive ability, especially that stab explosion. It made Zhu Tui realize that every senior who had made it onto the Longhu overall rankings was someone who lived up to their reputation. If he went any higher, the seniors he faced would become stronger and stronger. Therefore, it was not advisable to challenge the 76th place directly. 
Zhu Tuis Gaze finally landed on Kui Shi, who was ranked 79th on the Long Hu list. Second yardager, Quixi was a little strong. However, Kui Shi was the only extreme branch cultivator in the five rankings. Furthermore, Zhu Tui had the urge to fight Kui Shi two months ago. He wanted to know just how powerful the second year tiger Kui Shi was. What kind of improvement did the so-called extraterrestrial spot bring to Kui Shi? He would be able to figure out everything after a battle. Moreover, it was also a better choice to challenge Kui Shi than to plan for the worst case scenario. Professor Kui Il challenged Kui Shi, who is ranked 79th on the Long Hu overall rankings and is the second year tiger. The moment Zhu Tui said that the surrounding students and live streamers immediately exclaimed. No one had expected Zhu Tui to directly challenge the second year tiger Kui Shi. Kui Shi, who was in the audience, was also surprised. He did not expect Zutun to challenge him. However, after the surprise, he was overjoyed and immediately replied loudly. Zutui, it's great that you want to challenge me. However, I suggest that you postpone our challenge to the afternoon. Go back and have a good sleep at noon. Restore your mind power to its peak state. I want to fight you at your peak, Kui Shi shouted. Can't I do it no? Even if I win now, I won't feel comfortable. Zhu Tui thought about it and nodded. He agreed. All right, let's do it in the afternoon. An opponent like Kui Shi still needed to be respected. Zhu Tui turned around and said, Professor Ku, arrange for me to challenge Kui Shi in the afternoon. Ku Kingshan was about to nod when he suddenly frowned. Zhu Tui, you have to challenge Kui Shi again after this. Why? Zhu Tui was a little surprised. Someone wants to challenge you for the 85th place on the Long Hu list. After he finished speaking, Ku Kingshan's expression turned serious. He suddenly announced according to procedure, Zhu Tui, ranked 87th on the Long Hu overall rankings, Ki Sheng. He wants to challenge you for the 85th place on the Long Hu overall rankings. According to the rules of the Long Hu list, if one did not have a valid reason, they had to accept the challenge. Otherwise, they would be removed from the rankings. However, you've already fought two battles in a row today. According to the rules, you can delay the time you accept the challenge, but you can't delay the fight for more than three days. The moment Ku Qingshan asked the question, he gave Zhu Tui a way out. He could fight Qi Sheng three days later. Zhu Tui's gaze immediately landed on Qi Sheng's information displayed on the big screen. Qi Sheng, a third-year student from the supernatural branch of the mystery branch. Thank you, but he'll accept the challenge now. The moment the announcement of Zhu Tui, a freshman from the Mystery Branch's School of Enlightened Mind. Accepting Qi Sheng's challenge who was from the Mystery Branch's Supernatural Branch was made. The entire Huaxia Genetic Evolution College erupted once again. Zhu Tui was not the only one. When everyone saw this message, they understood one thing. The Supernatural Branch's counterattack was here.